Welcome to our video on STP theory. Today, we'll explore how segmentation, targeting, and positioning can revolutionize your marketing strategy. STP theory is essential for creating efficient and effective campaigns. First, we'll provide an overview of STP, a model that breaks down the market into segments, identifies target audiences within those segments, and positions products in a way that maximizes appeal. Understanding STP can drastically elevate your marketing efforts by ensuring that your campaigns are tailored to the right people in the right way. We'll dive deep into each aspect, segmentation, targeting, and positioning, discussing their importance and how they interconnect to form a cohesive strategy. By the end of this video, you'll see why STP is a powerful tool in the marketing world and how you can leverage it to enhance your business outcomes. So let's get started and unlock the potential of STP theory. Marketing can indeed be challenging. Imagine crafting a message without knowing who you're speaking to. Many marketers struggle with reaching the right audience. Without a clearly defined strategy, it can feel like shooting in the dark. Traditional approaches can be inefficient, failing to connect with those who genuinely need your product. This lack of a targeted approach leads to wasted resources and missed opportunities. So, how do we navigate these obstacles and ensure we're hitting the mark? That's where the theory of segmentation, targeting, and positioning, STP, comes into play. As we dive deeper, you'll discover how STP can transform your marketing efforts from scattered to strategic. Segmentation is the cornerstone of STP theory, marking the critical first step toward effective marketing. By definition, segmentation involves dividing the broader market into distinct, manageable groups based on shared characteristics. This process acknowledges that not all consumers are alike. They have varying needs, preferences, and behaviors. Understanding these differences allows us to tailor our marketing efforts to specific segments, making our strategies far more targeted and efficient. There are several ways to segment a market, each offering unique insights. Demographic segmentation divides the market based on age, gender, income, and education. Geographic segmentation considers location, climate, and regional preferences. Psychographic segmentation delves into lifestyle, interests, and values, while behavioral segmentation focuses on purchase behavior, usage rates, and brand loyalty. The benefits of segmentation are manifold. When you clearly identify and understand your segments, you can customize your product offerings, marketing campaigns, and communication strategies to meet the specific needs of each group. This level of personalization enhances customer satisfaction and loyalty, ultimately driving higher sales and profitability. By defining distinct segments, we're better equipped to select the most valuable audiences to target and craft messages that resonate with them. Next, let's explore how to identify and select these target segments effectively. Now that we've underscored the importance of segmentation, let's delve into its various types to help you refine your approach. Demographic segmentation focuses on attributes like age, age, gender, income, and education. Geographic segmentation divides the market based on location, such as cities, regions, or countries. Psychographic segmentation explores psychological traits, values, and lifestyles, providing a deeper understanding of consumer motivations. Finally, behavioral segmentation examines customer behavior, including purchasing habits, brand loyalty, and usage rates. Each type of segmentation offers unique insights and helps tailor your marketing strategy effectively. As we move forward, you'll learn how to select the right audience using these segments. Targeting is the crucial next step once we've identified our market segments. It's about selecting the segments that offer the most value to our business. We begin by evaluating each segment based on criteria like size, growth potential, accessibility, and compatibility with our objectives. One strategy for effective targeting is to focus on the segments where we can offer the most value and achieve the greatest return. This ensures our marketing efforts are both efficient and impactful. We'll closely examine each segment's needs, preferences, and behaviors, tailoring our messages and campaigns to resonate deeply with them. Competitive analysis is another vital strategy. Understanding the landscape helps us identify opportunities where we can distinguish ourselves. By assessing the strengths and weaknesses of our competitors, we can better position our offerings to meet unmet needs. 
Lastly, it's important to periodically revisit and refine our targeting strategy. Markets evolve, and so do consumer behaviors. Continuous monitoring and adjustment allow us to stay relevant and maximize our marketing efficacy. Now that we've grasped targeting, let's transition to positioning, crafting the right message that speaks directly to our chosen audience. In the crowded marketplace, crafting the right message is key. Positioning is about defining how your product stands out to the target audience, connecting with them on a deeper level. At the heart of positioning is the unique value proposition. This is what makes your product distinct and why customers should choose it over others. Think of it as the core benefit wrapped in a compelling message that speaks directly to your audience's needs and desires. There are several positioning strategies to consider. You could highlight superior quality, showcase better features, or emphasize cost-effectiveness. Alternatively, you could focus on solving a specific problem or aligning with your audience's lifestyle and values. Each strategy centers on differentiating your product from competitors in a way that's meaningful to your audience. For example, Imagine positioning a new eco-friendly detergent. The unique value proposition could be its ability to clean effectively without harming the environment. The message should emphasize this benefit, appealing to eco-conscious consumers who want to make a positive impact. The goal is to ensure that whenever your target audience thinks of a need, your product is top of mind as the go-to solution. Successful positioning goes beyond advertising slogans. It's embedded in the product experience, customer service, and brand touch points. Next, we'll illustrate positioning through a real-world case study, revealing how it can transform business outcomes. Let's look at a real-world example of STP in action. Imagine a company that harnessed the power of segmentation, targeting, and positioning to transform its approach. They began by meticulously segmenting their market, identifying key demographics and behaviors, then, they zeroed in on the most promising segments, tailoring their messaging and strategies specifically for them. The results were astounding. Not only did they see a significant increase in customer engagement, but their sales skyrocketed. This case study demonstrates that when done right, STP theory can lead to remarkable growth and success in today's competitive market. Stay tuned to see just how implementing STP theory can benefit your marketing strategy. The benefits of applying STP theory are transformative. First and foremost, it leads to increased efficiency. By clearly defining and targeting specific market segments, companies can streamline their marketing efforts, ensuring resources are allocated effectively. This targeted approach prevents wastage and maximizes impact. Better customer satisfaction is another significant outcome. Tailoring products and messages to meet the unique needs of different customer groups fosters a more personal and relevant experience, building stronger relationships with customers. Finally, these improvements culminate in a higher ROI. Efficient resource use and satisfied customers lead to increased loyalty and higher sales. By optimizing your marketing strategy through STP theory, you can unlock significant financial gains and achieve sustainable growth. Next, we'll discuss how avoiding common pitfalls ensures successful implementation, setting the stage for long-term success. While STP theory holds immense potential, it's essential to be mindful of common pitfalls. Missteps like over-segmenting the market or misinterpreting data can derail your efforts. To navigate these challenges, ensure your market segments are not too narrow or too broad. Consistently analyze data to keep your strategies aligned with current trends and customer behavior. Additionally, avoid relying solely on past successes. Be adaptable and open to evolving market dynamics. Communication within your team is crucial. Everyone should understand the strategy to ensure unified execution. Remember, successful implementation requires continuous refinement and alignment with real-world changes. Keep these tips in mind to harness the full power of STP theory. Next, a final recap and actionable steps you can apply right away. In conclusion, STP theory is a powerful tool for marketers. By segmenting your audience, targeting the most valuable groups, and positioning your product effectively, you can achieve remarkable results. Start applying STP today to see real improvements in your marketing efforts. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more valuable marketing insights.